Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more EU4. And we are at war with like half the world, literally. Look at all this. <laughs> I love it. And we're winning. And we're winning quite handedly as well. Um, as soon as I siege back all this land, I will be able to actually um, probably um, peace out. The only issue is, is that his war enthusiasm is going to stay pretty good. Um, the only reason... Very good, our colony is done. Um, the only thing that would be good is, um, I'm saying, the only issue is is that his uh, enthusiasm is going to be pretty high for quite a while. So, Commonwealth has medium enthusiasm. After Commonwealth pieces out, relative strength of alliances will go down a bit as well. So that'll be good for us. But, uh, dude is still pretty young. We'll keep him. Oh, look at this. That's so good. Uh, need to take Zanzibar back. I did, but for some reason... It says I don't have colonial range, though. But I definitely do. Excuse me? I, why does it keep changing my colonial range, though? No, I need this province, dude. I need it. I'm so confused. How is this out of my range now? But it wasn't before. Do I need a trade range guy? Because I'll get him. I mean, a co colonial range guy. I'll, I'll spend... I'll take a loan out and get him. I don't care. Yeah, I'll take a loan out. Screw it. Oops. I didn't mean to fire him. Um, here we go. So... These guys would actually probably give me fleet basing, so I could actually uh, get up there right now if I wanted to. Charge us two ducats a month. I think that's worth. Let's go ahead and down and see if we can siege down some land down here in South Africa as well. His war exhaustion actually will continue to, st t to stack up, which is going to be really good. Okay, I love losing stab. Super cool. So, oh no, 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 no. Oh, they've landed men and I didn't catch it. So upset. They landed some more men over here as well. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, well, let's get these guys up here. Definitely gonna need to handle this. This we can get later. Doesn't really matter a whole lot. Um, to be honest with you, the longer this war drags out, the closer we are to getting these guys all sorted out. So it's kind of a good thing, if anything. Um, yeah, we're going to have to definitely get those guys off this island, which is unfortunate. Didn't even realize they were in the home islands. Um, where's our navy at? There they go. Yeah, this is unfortunate. So these guys just have nine mercs, so let's go ahead and get them a few more. There we go. Have you guys run down here. There we go. Just need to get you guys home. The sooner we kill those guys off, the better. Um, it's not good. This isn't so bad. Um, honestly, after we get up there and we can, um, uh, blockade their home ports, we'll be able to just do whatever we want with them. So we'll be good. So I want you guys to try. Let's see here. Hopefully they don't, we're not attacking them in the woods. That would be unfortunate. Very good. And the boat bomb is occurring right now. Let's go ahead and blockade this straight, which isn't actually going to stop them. But now they're locked here, which is fine. Um, it's a high level fort, so there's nothing we can do about it. But it's our fort, so it's not a big deal. Their stuff has gone down. But I still need to get this colonial range person. So let's see here. Now it is. Very good. 
So this is the piece that we're looking for here. Um, with some absolutism, we might be able to even get it. No. Hmm. They might have even pulled their men away. So they're all on medium enthusiasm because length of war is stacking up. Where did they get all that war score? Literally from this this uh, occupation right here. Let's go ahead and blockade that so we can get that little bit of extra oomph we need. Right. Our admiral is dad, which is sad, man. Feels sad, man. Feels very sad, man. So they can attack me here if they want, but I uh, don't think it'll go well for them because we're flanking them and they have... Actually, we can totally attack them here. They have cannons, but we they have cav... Like, they have an unbalanced cavalry row, so, uh, probably not in your best interest to be doing that. Let's see if we can stack wipe them there. Uh, I'd rather not loot my own lands? I don't know why this is a thing. Like, this is the fort that I own, and I'm devastating my own lands, which is so annoying. I really wish that that would not be a thing, but it is. go you guys are going to get oomph oofed over here looks like we can actually take our next thing which is going to be what diplomat or stab cost sounds good and there we go now they have low enthusiasm and uh somehow the war score cost went up but we'll be able to get that and i can actually just hold out get some more war score and uh I will be able to actually take money from them, which is so funny. Yo, I want to go up and I want to blockade them. Like, I want to. Ideally, I will actually land some men. So Commonwealth wants out. So this is like, we're good. We're totally good. Commonwealth wants out. That lowers their relative strength of alliance by quite a bit. Get you guys grouped up over here. Um... They have no, literally no men on the map anywhere that I can see. Um, I'm not so inclined to actually, like, try to get men around the world, but, uh... Let's see here. Let's have a random light ship over here. So let's go ahead and get you over there. Let's go ahead and just, yeah, no, it's not worth it. It's definitely not worth it. Uh, we can get some guys over here though, cause Sunda is gonna be our next goal. Let's get you guys over here, down in like, probably somewhere down here that doesn't have like a stupid low supply limit. It's all pretty low. Okay, very good. Um, let's just have you come over there then. It's fine. Their enthusiasm just went up for literally no reason. Well, that's pretty annoying, but uh, it's fine. I need them to probably be low enthusiasm or they're not going to peace out. No, that's not true. They will. All right, here we go. Boom, boom. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. We now have some provinces over here. Um, I don't need to core up all this either. Um, so are these all finished now? This one is not. Ideally we can get our guy there, but it probably will be done before he gets there. Um, so we have one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. So I don't need to core this one up. This will give it, get given to him automatically. And this, um, let's get that one out of there. Ugh. Hideous. There we go. And perfect. There we go. Now we're done. Um, I don't know, actually, I have an extra merchant now for some reason. Oh, right, because global, global trade and all that. So let's go ahead and collect from here. And then have you guys head on over to uh, Gujarat to privateer some more. 
so much. Ooh. Yeah, and that the thing is, is that like literally hurts so much upstream up here. Like English Channel, we can go ahead and actually cancel our fleet basing as right as well. Let's go ahead and uh, cancel that. Very good. I actually don't know if I need to have this anymore, but uh. No, what? Stop. No. There we go. Oh, I got a free core on that because it finished it when I actually already had it. So I can actually... So I have one, two, three, four. I just need one more core here. Um, which ones am I coring up right now then? Save some admin points, right? Um... So this one's six and this one's eight. So let's go ahead and uh, get that admin back. There we go. According to my calculations, we should be good to go then. Um, well, that's quite good. That means we can actually get a claim on uh, the French then. Who uh, clearly will not have the naval supremacy that the other guys will. So I do need to figure out a way to get to war with these guys. Bengal, yes. Yes, yes, yes. But we can manage that somehow. Sir Hind, where are you guys at? Oh, wow. Actually, don't really know if I know you or not, but they're in Nobobet. Nobobet? Nobobate? No. Um, well, we definitely are due to do some raiding, so let's go ahead and do that. Do some raiding, why not, you know? Do some rating. Speed 5 rating. Speed 5 rating. Feels good, man. Speed 5 rating. Speed 5 rating. Let's go ahead and have you guys head on down there. I love me some speed 5 rating. Pay off my debts. Take admin or take diplotech. Um. And then. Let's go ahead and come on up here and do some more speed 5 rating before we attack these dudes down here in Sunda. There we go. There we go. Have you guys head on down here and up this way. And we just sit back and speed 5 raid. That's all we have to do. Come on, baby. Give me that speed five raid. And all that devastation. <laughs> Unfortunate, because this land is still devastated from those, uh, the hurricane, or the tsunami. But, uh, let's go ahead and also raid this as well. I might actually not even be able to get Gujarat. So let's go ahead and privateer in Gujarat again. And then, where's my navy at? There we go. Go ahead and get you guys over here. We need to just declare this war. Be oh, we lost our tree or uh, our claim on them. Feels bad, man. That's fine. Go ahead and make sure we are uh, not falling behind on nil. But we do want to get as much. Um, What's the word I'm looking for? Absolutism as possible. Sending privateers against those guys has given me a lot of PP. Wow. And we're the fourth great power now. We're very close to passing Portugal as well, which is just so funny. I love that. Great efficiency. Don't care. Most of my money comes from privateering. So good, man. Uh, the Nanban incident. Salavada gets uh, local trade power and goods produced for 10 years. Lots of money. Or I get domestic trade power. I'll take the money. Sounds good to me. And bam, thank you, ma'am. We have lots of money now. So let's go ahead. I wonder, if I were to get fleet basing rights from these guys, 
Would I be able to send some guys to privateer? I can. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go ahead and get some guys up into, um... Uh, where am I looking? English Channel? No. Uh, Sevilla. That's where I want to be. I can't reach that? Okay. Really? Unfortunate. Well, I won't do the English Channel because I don't want them to hate me quite yet. Let's see here. We could get some fleet basing from Milan, maybe. That's an option. Man, these guys are so far away that it takes so long for my diplomat to get there and get back. Let's go ahead and improve with you. I will just take the... Eh, I probably should have taken the stab. Ooh, the Commonwealth has elected that... Okay. Uh, well, that's really interesting. Don't think anything's gonna really come of it, but let's make sure you guys don't have any unrest. Uh, let's go ahead and get some absolutism there. So it does look like we're end gonna end up getting some particularists. So I don't know where they're gonna be. Kind of hope not, though. Okay, so they're all, they're both over here. That's not a big deal then. Be able to go handle those guys and then we can... Wait, did we get Australia? Oh, we're waiting on the cores to finish. So this guy's really old. Um, still gonna keep him anyways for the free points. Plus he's a 666 now. So let's get these guys up here. Kill off these particularists. No, oh, come on now. We'll wait. Next idea group I still haven't really decided on, honestly. Okay. Japanese Australia. Hello. I love it. And then as soon as we see these stuff back, it'll actually get given to them anyway, so that's good. Very good. Oh, it's their capital? <laughs> their capital became this the place that was sieged down. That's funny. Alright, cool. So, are we gonna go... Expansion would be good, but I also don't think it's necessary. Admin would be good. Economic is okay. Though I really do think... Naval makes the most sense. Naval does make the most sense. Heavy ship combat ability is going to be so good. Yep, we're doing it. We're doing it. I don't care. Even if it is a Mimi, we're doing it. Um, I'm going to focus it as well. Go ahead and grab everybody. Get you all over there. Very good. And there we go. We now have a vassal. We have a colony, I should say. Okay, cool. So, are you guys willing to colonize? What's your What's your economy looking like? So we want to make sure that they have at least a plus two, but I also don't really have that many ducats a month to uh, to subsidize, so I probably can't really do much right now. So we got a claim right here. Let's see what's going on over here. Which one is worth claiming? 15, 19, 18. So let's go ahead and claim this guy here. Here we go. Let's get our... Get our army selected and over here. And we're just gonna stomp these guys. Their allies are... At least, at least I checked. Yep, an OPM. And an OPM. So, we're good. We are totally good. I also need another... Another, uh, see if you guys will give us fleet basing rights now. Come on now. They're gonna like me. I'm gonna make you guys love me. Come on, one more month. Let's go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 
I just want those fleet basing rights and I can send some pirates to go uh, take care of Sevilla. So let's make another pirate fleet over here in Japan. Spain is attacking Brunei. Palawan? Where's Palawan? Oh, interesting. All right, do your best. Let's go ahead and attack these bros here whenever we get our diplomat back. Very good. And uh, whenever this guy gets back, we can go ahead and uh, get fleet basing rights from these guys here, which will at least give us um, Genoa, but I would like Sevilla or maybe like uh, Constantinople. Let's see here. For some reason, none of these guys are privateering. So let's see here. Can we reach Sevilla now? We can. Yes. That is so good. All right. You guys should be privateering. Let's have you guys go down to uh, Gujarat. You guys uh, just need to repair, apparently. Let's go ahead and have you send home some people. Uh, all right, all right, all right. There we go. Cool. Now we just need to win. Looks like he's at war with a couple of people right now. All right, cool. There we go. Return province is overpowered, apparently. Go ahead and blockade some stuff for them. He's got an army somewhere. I don't know where, but he's got one. Good. I know we're focusing a naval idea, but uh, um, a lot of money for what? Tax and provincial trade power? Yeah. Sure, sounds good. Go ahead and get you guys over there as well. So open prestige for base tax. Um. I'm pretty much, I want the institution spread. So, so what is? Okay, so dev cost, institution spread, idea cost is isolationism, stab cost, war score. So I think open is probably best if I had to guess. So I want to take, well, let's see here. I know I don't want to. I'm doing a miltech group, but we, we need this. We need this. So let's go ahead. And we're going to take as much as we possibly can. As soon as we win his capital in this fort here, we'll be able to uh, probably peace out. Up and coming pirate. Unfortunately. Let's get a couple more months out of him if we can. Uh, go ahead and focus mill probably. There we go. Go ahead and take some take some monies. Nah, it's not worth. Shorter truce is probably preferred. We can aff afford the uh, the coring cost as well, which is good. We are going to go ahead and um, hold the army here. Obviously, there are going to be rebels there. Uh, basically, once they're cored up, I'm probably going to actually lower their autonomy. See how how trade goods are looking down here. Is there any gold? No gold, unfortunate. Separatist for Emiretti. Hmm. Yes. 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 All right. Also, let's see here. How's privateering going in Sevilla? They're there. Are they not? All right. They're doing it. Go ahead and actually send you guys over to privateer in uh, Genoa. Mm, I need to be careful though. Because if I privateer against them, they're going to get mad and they're going to cut their, uh, their fleet basing rights. Let's actually have you go ahead and privateer in uh, Constantinople. Yes. That sounds great. St. Helena. 
So I'll suppress these rebels, but I kind of don't really care if they fire. Um, at the end of the day, it's really mostly about... Um, it's mostly about just hurting... Um, I forgot what I was going to be saying there. Don't want this, though. Definitely don't want corruption. So let's go ahead and root that out. We're making so much money right now. This is crazy. All oh, right, I'm going to lower the autonomy here for absolutism anyway, so it's not a big deal, but... Also want to finish up annexing this dude. Privateers. Hey. Oh, I forgot about this. Okay, cool. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're uh we're doing okay. Our commandant is dead. Go ahead and go with uh whoever's cheap. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Though admittedly I don't really need cheap, I need mill points, so we'll go ahead and take him instead. It's actually a lot of morale. Check out our army quality. Oh, we actually have the most in the world. I love that. Oh, that's so funny. All right, cool. So, we are taking a lot from them. We're also taking a lot from them as well. Oh my gosh, really? Hold up. Wow, man. That's crazy. And that causes the Ottomans to make a lot less money. I'm already thick. Um, it causes Spain to make a lot less money. Like, Spain is collecting 20 ducats here right now. 20! That's crazy. And they're even protecting against pirates. Wow. That is nuts. That's actually nuts. Um, let's see here. Let's see if I can get some fleet basing rights from somebody not in the English Channel. Like, somebody like... Yeah. Let's see, I wonder. So good, man. Naval leader shock. It's only a matter of time, man. It, the, the, we're just at that point now where it's like, how do we jump off? How do we jump off over here? Do I know CBM? Because that seems like a bad call, right? I could. I very easily could. I need to get to war with Bengal. I don't know how I do that. Humiliate rival, but that doesn't give me a legitimate way to, uh... How to get to war with him, though. Bamanis? Don't have any way to get a claim on him. Hmm, unfortunate. Well, we'll sort it out in the next one. Let's see if we can get that annexation finished real quick, though. I would like that. Oh my gosh, we're taking so many money, so much money from the Spanish. This is actually crazy. Um, geez, oh Pete. All right, let's give you guys a fort as well on your capital. That sounds about right. Hope you guys are enjoying, and if you are, please show your support and leave a like. Helps the channel out a ton. And uh, also, if you would like to see some more stuff like this, um, you can subscribe. About 60% of my viewers are not subscribed. And so, if you want to subscribe, that's the best way to keep up to date with the channel. If you want to also uh, check out the Discord or support the channel on Patreon, the links for those will be... The links for those will be in the description down below. But uh, let's finish up this annexation progress. For some reason, it's going down. It just went down. Was that at 99? And we're still privateering a ton of money. Very good. Could have sworn that it went down. Let's go ahead and... Uh... My bad. I know I said I'm going to finish this up. Oh my gosh. We're taking so much money from them. But I don't think I got that money, which is weird as well. So this is all good to go. Let's go ahead, state this up. And then go ahead and decrease the autonomy. Giving us a little bit of absolutism there. Integration is a slow process indeed. We have some some dudes over here. So Imarina, Imarina. Is it really just this one province he's got a claim on it? The marina? It really is. Alright, cool. 
Oh, no, no, no. Don't send those guys up there. All right, regardless, I hope you guys are enjoying. And if you are, show your support and leave a like and all that good stuff. I'm going to kill these rebels, and I will see you guys in the next episode. So this is Chewy Shoot, and I will catch you guys later. A big special thanks to Bloodbound92, Valentel, CWG, Dutch Terror, J Clampett, Yudaldo, Classified for Life, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Palmer, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal, and all my other awesome supporters on Patreon. I appreciate you guys. Check out the two series linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.